Oshun State Chapter of the PDP and APC straight words over mining revenue. And INEC warns politicians and their supporters against bullying hate speech during campaign. And this is Plus Politics. My name is Nyamgul Agaji. The war of words between the People's Democratic Party and the All Progressives Congress over an alleged non-remittance of the revenue due to Oshun State through the mining sector has continued with the PDP accusing the opposition party in the state of partnering with the mining company to deny the state its revenue. Earlier, the APC in a statement by its acting chairman, Tajuddin Lawal, had berated the state governor, Senator Ademola Deleke, over his claim that 13% derivation on revenue from mining was not remitted to the previous administrations. The statement read that there are credible reports on how the mining companies regularly settled top officials in the past administration. Well, joining us to discuss this is Tunji Abdul Hamid, a legal practitioner. Good evening, Tunji, Tunji and welcome to the program. Good evening, Gaiji. How are you? It's my pleasure to be here. Okay. It's a pleasure to have you join us. Uh, well, this trading of words between the APC and the PDP, the major parties in that state of Oshun, uh, I don't know, okay, maybe they are reverting now to Oshun state, no longer state of Oshun. But the trading of words between these parties is um, worrisome. What are the laws regarding mining and the revenues that are supposed to accrue to the state? Well, when you talk about mining in Nigeria, under our constitution, it's, an, it's under an exclusive list. In other words, it's, a, it's, just, it's, it's, it's in that category of, a law of, 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 of uh, natural resources that, that, is, that is considered to be under the control of the federal government. In other words, the only federal government can make law on it. And it's, it's like uh, in, the, in the same class with the uh, oil. In other words, where in a state wherever you have oil, those in the state are the owner, are, are, the can only is, is owned by the federal government, and those in the state, the state can only get the derivative from the from the federal government. So mining uh, under the law is under the exclusive list, and it's a, it, 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 that which means is uh, within the powers of the federal a federation to make a law on it. So any policy, any law that has to do with mining. We have to come from the federation. So, and whatever money that we accrue from it is is to the federation. What the state will get is what we call the federation, which is a, it has been said in 2017 or so, 19, to be 13 percent uh, uh, to the federal government. I think that I'm, I'm not even aware that, that it is covered by law. I think that that 13 percent is a, is a policy, a government policy to say, look, let's encourage states who are active in mining a, a participation. I think that is the position regarding that one. So it's within the, the ambit of the federal government to make law and to collect revenue from that uh, uh, part, particular natural uh, resources in the state. The state will be entitled to what we call derivation. Okay, apart from this derivation that we're talking about, 13%, yes, it has been there on the front burner for a long time. And it's, it was only paid by this administration to all the states, especially like the oil producing states. They, uh, they had their money paid to them uh, in full. And that's what is causing commotion right now within the oil producing states and all that. But the accusation here from uh, these two parties is that uh, the money that is supposed to come from mining to the state is not getting to the state. So the PDP is now saying that some, some companies and people high up in government, in the previous government, uh, were just having an understanding and they were paying this money to them directly and not coming to the state. Are you telling me that apart from the 13% derivation, there's no other form of money that should have come to the state being that they own these natural resources in their own states? Legally speaking, or strictly speaking, they don't have any other revenue apart from those uh, lo locally generated revenue. In other words, in terms of uh, reality and also other things that can be collected from the, from the, what's it called, the company to uh, as contribution or, or to, the, to the state. In other words, it's not as if uh, it's, it's by law 
they are entitled to any other uh, uh, revenue from those uh, miners. Uh, apart from the, in, in terms of mining itself, other aspects of the mining, they may be asking for certain uh, uh, things. They're not mining itself. They may be asking that the those the miners will be able to do things to ensure that the community where they work are are, are taken care of, or so some things that have been destroyed are, are put in proper places. But uh, they talk, talking about the uh, generation of revenue from the mining itself is only the federal government that can ask for a fund in that in that regard. They, can, they only need to give a percentage to to the state. So probably what is it, what is confusing here is maybe may likely be the adjective used by the. PDP governor, I mean, the government uh, that is in power now, they maybe maybe the what they are saying that is that since when from the record they have, there is no traces or there is nothing to show that those money regarding that mining, uh, mining uh, generated from the mining or the revenue, thirteen percent of the uh, revenue collected from the government is in the account of the state uh, government. Probably that the use of adjective of uh, adjective to say that look, the 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 the, the state did not. Collect money from the federal, uh, did not give them the, the 13 percent uh, derivative. Uh, 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 it it may, be, may be wrong. The proper adjective is to say that look, the money paid by the federal government as as derivative uh, the, 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 for, for for the mining is not. There is no record to show that this money is in our in our account. And probably like say we're in Nigeria, where the, it may be it may be true that some people or individual are trying to are just collecting the money on their own as a personal thing and don't take it uh, in that regard because. The you know you remember in in, in San Fernando who said is that they have a good and they are they are mining it and they are they are taking the money they are they are spending the money on their own without even the government taking anything from it. So as far as I'm concerned, probably what is issue here is the use of adjective by the by the PDP and and, and not not probably because uh, they are making a wrong a, 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 a allegation here in terms of uh, probably because you see the the APC uh, the former government the, the, the government did not say. Money were collected and this money were in their accounts. If they say the money were collected and it's in their accounts, to be a different uh, story. But they were just saying that look, the, we don't collect money. It's only the government that gives us money. Why are you giving any money or not? Why are you giving any money? If you are giving money, can you show where the monies are in the, uh, in, in that place? So those are the things I think they should be talking about. And you see, the problem we have in this country is that where a government is going, another one is coming in. Mm. There is no cooperation because they don't do, they don't behave as if they are, they are working in the interest of the of, of the people. You will recall that uh, the the former uh, government, that is a, the led by uh, 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 Governor, I, I, I forgot his name now, the immediate past uh, uh, governor of uh, uh, some state. He, 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 we are we were told that there was no any transition uh, to collaborate and to, uh, to discuss. Uh, uh, harmonize the, the, the records on grant, and this is why we are. That's why we are hiring all this. Because if that has been done, probably all this thing will have been explained, and then we will have been able to achieve whatever they want to achieve here. Because there is no record now. So what I expect the APC, uh, the former, uh, the, the former government, is to just to explain to them: look, the money collected from the federal government as a remedy for this uh, mining are in social social place. Are, 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 these are the money they have been used for this. They have been used for that, or they are somewhere here. I expect that to, 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 to come back. They are playing to the gallery by talking about adjective. They are by talking about the word, the, the, the adjective used by the government in, in, in asking for that uh, money. You see, we don't have, uh, we, don't, we, we need to demand for accountability in this country because that's part of the corruption. There will be, uh, it's not that of place to, to, to realize as well that certain people are collecting the money individually. It's an allegation for now until it's proven. So, what I expect the current government to do is to set up that committee and do a proper investigation and then. Uh, Ensure that people who are corporate uh, are, are capable in this regard are taken to court, and so that that's when we know what is right. Or people are asked questions, and so that they're able to trace where the monies are, and then there won't be the issue of uh, the money is not there or is there will not be will not be will not be. I expect this current government to hand over to them and tell them so so amount of money has been donated for mining, and this is this is where they have, and this is what have been used for. But the, the, the current government is saying, look, we have no traces regarding where these monies are. So it means the money has been collected and nobody has been accounted, uh, it was not accounted for by the, by the past uh, government. That is my own understanding of what is happening here. Yeah, but I, I'm getting confused because when we heard about the 13% derivation fund that was paid, it was paid to oil producing states. And as we know, the natural resources that are in Oshun State are granite, uh, columbite, talc, uh, tantalite, and uh, tourmaline. I don't see this one as 
natural resources that the federal government has put its eyes as it is on and they are mining and getting revenue that they can share with the states. If I'm wrong, maybe you correct me there. You just alluded to the fact that Zamfara has gold no, and they you, mine you, it and they don't even you, uh, give to the federal government. Is it not possible that this is the same thing that is happening here and the federal government has not really come into that industry in the state and the money that is being made is just made by the state itself and nobody is seeing this money? Uh, probably the fact that the federal government is not putting eyes in it or is not do, doing its job in terms of uh, ensuring that this money coming from this uh, uh, the, the, the natural resources are, 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 are given to the federal government does not, does not make it right. By law, I've said it earlier, that mining is under the exclusive list, which means it's only the federal government that make law on it. So what I'm saying is that, look, by, by our law, whatever is on, beneath the land the law is owned by the federal government. And that's why you see oil are being controlled by the federal government. So if you see anything beneath the plants, if you if you dig anything and they are under the plant, they, they are owned by the federal government. And so when, you, when, 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 when things are under the control of the federal government, the federal government will be the one to collect money from it. And that's why mining is one of them. That is under the control of the federal government in terms of our law. So by law, it is on the exclusive list. And though the federal government, uh, the, the federal government is, 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 is the one that deals with mining in terms of uh, uh, policy and, uh, and law. So as far as I'm concerned, whether they have been living up to their responsibility in terms of ensuring that money generated from this uh, natural resources are taken are given to the federal government does not make it right when you are asking questions regarding how, where the monies are. So if, they have been, if, they, if money has been taken from that uh, area and it's not been remitted to the federal government, that is, that is, that is, that is a, a, an a, a abnormality as far as I'm concerned under the law because the law does not, the state government has no power to control whatever that, that generated from the money. Otherwise, those who own oil can also say, look, since uh, these people who are mining their, 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 their things here and they are taking the money for themselves, we all equally will not will be taking our money and then we won't allow the federal government to take it. And, and I think uh, that is what is the, the issue is. So there is no confusion here. Mining is, is under the control of the federal government. So whether, whether there's money coming from there to any purse, maybe even the PDP doesn't have the right to ask the state government because it should have been the federal government uh, that uh, should have done the collection of whatever revenue that is supposed to come from that whatever kind of mining they're doing in Oshun State. Am I right? You are right in a way. But the question being asked is that they were saying that money were paid yes. for, 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 to the state and in terms of for, 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 for mining. And they are asking, where is this money? Where, where, did, they, where did they put it? There's, because there's no, according to them, that there's no any trace as regards where the money is. So the question is... But should, there, is but should there be a trace? Because it's not even their responsibility to collect the money. So if money is being collected, is no, that they, not no, illegal? No, they, they, the federal government collects the, the, the federal government collects the entire money. They will now give the state 13% from the money generated. So if they, if they are now telling us that, look, no money was generated... That's a different question. But what we have been told here is that monies were being generated and 13% were being given. I'm, talk, I'm quoting them now the waters. Yes, I'm not yeah. saying that is, a, that is a correct position. So they, 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 if that is the case, what they are saying is that more, it is assumed that money has been generated and 13% have been paid to the state. But there is no traces as to where the monies uh, were in the account. So the, the, the past government need to come and do some explanation as regards where these monies are, or well, whether or not no money was paid to them. And if no money was paid to them, they now have to take their case to the federal government to ask, look, so 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 thing was done in this area, and so so thing has been done. Where is the money? So I, I think that is, that is the proper no, let, let, let me quote, the right question from the right Let me quote the what, what the statement said, a, a part of what the statement said. It said, we are not surprised as there are credible reports on how the mining companies regularly settle top officials of the APC and its government. When the people's governor now exposes the nest of corruption, the state APC cannot disguise to manifest in its complicity. Now, this means that they're not even talking about the money that may have come from the federal government. They're talking about money that comes directly from whichever company is mining in Oshun State to the coffers of chieftains of the APC. That's their, their grouse. They're not even talking about the 13% derivation, whether it came to the state or not. But this is what they're talking about. And my question was simply that... Uh, I, I, yeah, okay. You understand now where I was coming from? No, no, ask a question. Ask a question. Ask a question. Yes, I was asking that if 
this money they're talking about is not what should have gone to the federal government and officially the federal government releases it to the state that has these natural resources. Is it not that maybe this understanding is not something that even the PDP should try to find out what is happening because it's not, first of all, it is not right, like you said, no matter what is going on, it is illegal that is going on. So how can the PDP ask for something that is not even a formal thing that was done? Do they even have that right? No, what, 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 we're saying, what they are saying is that money have, have been generated and yes. the money have been paid. 13% have been paid. No, no, no. They didn't even states. talk about the 13%. That, 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 that is their own allegation. That is their own allegation. But the APC is saying that, look, they, they don't know what they are saying. Because the, the, the issue of mining is within the federal government uh, 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 ambit. And so it's all within our power. So if what the issue here is that it's for the, the, the past government to come and do some explanation to us to, to them. Say, so look, mm. we have not collected any money from the from from, from these people. Why have you not collected money? Uh, the fact, sorry, the federal government have not, uh, 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 haven't paid us anything since this thing. In other words, those who have been mining there are mining without even the because I know for you to be able to mine, you must have license from the federal government. So if you have a license and you're mining and more money is being remitted to the federal government, something is fishing somewhere. So in, it, it, that means the allegation that some people are collecting, are collecting the money mm. personally, it may be right. You, you get my point. The point is that, look, this money or knowledge ought to, to, to go to what's it called? The federal government. They are the owner of the money. And they are supposed to pay the state 13% from money generated because you, they give license to those who mine. So if you give me, if you, can, you can't mine that, I said you are saying they are mining illegally. If, they are, if, they, if you don't have license to mine and they are mining, then maybe that's why the federal government is not aware. And that's why it's not let, let, get, getting money or revenue from. These are the kind of things we are saying that let's block all the loopholes where the monies are going from. Some people are making money personally mm. in this in this area. That's why you are not hearing anything. So the, in, this, in this case, this will also expose the federal government. If truly the, this, the, 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 these people are licensed and more money is being, generated, is, being, is being given to the federal government, and the government is not asking questions, it, uh, it shows that some people are under it, collecting money from mm. it, which means the allegation may be right. It may, they, they, they may have used the wrong adjective in terms of uh, how they are claiming it. But the point is that who is, the question is who is collecting this revenue yeah. from these people? Is okay. it the federal government? Is it individual from the state? Let's know all this issue. We need to bring this out so that people will know. And it's so that because as, once you don't punish people for, for, for crime, it will continue. And that's why we're having this con uh, corruption continuing in this industry. So we need, this, this question needs to be asked. There must be accountability. Mm. There must be a record of whether or not money is paid or money is not paid, or maybe one, whether or not money is collected or money is not collected. So if there's no money collected from anybody, then we we'll say no. Federal government, why have you not collected your money? And because these people have been working mm. for years and they've been, they've been mining for years, and they are, they are supposed to remit a certain amount to you, and you are supposed to give 13% to the, to, 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 to the state. Yeah. Where are these money? So those questions are, need to be asked. So whether or not they are collecting, the federal government is not pushing its eyes in it. It shows that some people, individ some individuals, mm. are collecting the money on behalf of the federal government and putting it in their own personal pockets. Uh, but whether the things were moving right, the, the, the mining was done legally or not, and money is changing hands, are there no other avenues that uh, could be used to checkmate these people, to find out, to audit these people that have left government. Now the two groups that are very major groups in a state are fighting dirty in the outside, like, like in the marketplace. What could have been done to show more civility, uh, to show that uh, there is a system put in place so that things like this, if they do happen, this is how we expose them. Instead of just saying we have credible information, credible information from where, we don't know. How are you fighting with this credible information? We don't know. They're just talking on the, uh, on the papers. What other way could they have used to bring out the truth about what is going on in Oshun State? The, the only way to, uh, to, uh, to uh, explain this to us is to tell us that we, from the handing over the document that was given to us, we cannot find this, we cannot find that. But unfortunately, I'm not, aware, I'm not sure whether or not that handover was properly done. I'm not, sure, I'm not aware whether or not any document was handed over to them to explain the state of things as at when they entered the government and as at when they are going out. Because, uh, because we, there was an information before the handing over that uh, there was no issue, there was no transition committee set yeah. up. Yeah. From, you know, when you say transition committee, that means from both sides, the incoming governor and the outgoing out out governor, we have people who come together, look at the state of things, explain things to themselves, and then ask questions 
as to what are, what has happened. I'm not sure this happened. So the issue is that so until we learn those who are the outgoing government learn to ensure that things are done properly by way of handing over to the incoming government, we continue to hear this because when you don't hand over properly to me, I will be that that means I will now be looking fishing for all this information. So and, 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 and what I expect them to do now is to call people in, who are in those category authority, authority who are in charge at that time to ask them proper questions regarding what to do. I think this is being done now. So what we need to do is, is to ask questions. But that is that's not that's that's that is that's not the proper way. The proper way is if we have if the handover and over has been done properly, this thing will have been explained. And if it's not explained, question will be asked: Why is this not contained in your report? Why is this not part of your report to us? Or what is what is happening here? So as as it is now. They or the PDP also need to come out and tell us where they get this credible information from. Yeah. Who get this? Is it from the records? Is it from individuals? Who are these individuals? Have you have you questioned them? Where 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 they get credible information from? Or is it from the company itself? If it's from the company, can they can they point out who are who are collecting this money? Because the most know people they are paying to. Mm. So these are the issues we need to. These are the way we need to to, to what, what the things that they need that, that, that must be done. Everything must be transparent. We need to do things clearly. Otherwise, we will continue to be in this matter. When you are going out as an outgoing government, uh, government, hand over properly to the incoming government, so that the issue of you know I don't see this, I don't see that, will not happen. It will be documented. Whatever you have handed over to them, and whatever you say is whatever they are not clear about, they call you to ask you questions. Come and answer it. It's a service to the state. You are not, you are not. What you are doing is not. You are not. You are not trying to play politics here. You what you are doing is in the interest of the state. And if the state are not enjoying what you are doing in the name of uh, politics, then you are not you are not serving people. The people should be the paramount interest, not about uh, you ensuring that look the incoming governor will not will not understand what is happening and will not be able to achieve his result in this, in this regard. This what I see here is politics. People don't want any other the, uh, successful government. Uh, the, the the government that is succeeding them, especially when they are not in the same part from the same party to succeed, so that they will have opportunity to also say we want to come back or, or some other thing. So you need to you need to say, look, we are all working for the state. We are all at our work. Whether I am from the PDP or I'm from the APC, what we are fighting for is in the interest of the state. So whatever that will benefit the state should be in our interest, should be at the paramount in our in our mind, and not politics. And what I see here is politics. So we can get results by way of asking asking uh, more questions from the outgoing uh, uh, government. They need to come and answer questions, uh, some questions. They need to answer, they need to dig into it and say, look, who are those collecting this money? Are there money being paid? Are there no money being paid? If, if money are not being paid, then you have to move to the federal government and say, look, why are these people not paying when they have license from you? Okay. Or what is happening? Or are they being given to, to, to operate freely? Or what, or what, is, the, what, is, the, what is the issue? So we need to work in, in line with our law in this country. Otherwise, we'll continue to be where we are. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, we need to ask the right questions and get the right answers. We right, ask the right people for the right explanations that we need so that we can move forward. I'd like to thank you, Tunji, for coming on the show and sharing your perspective with us. Thank you so much for being a part of the program. Thank you for having me. It's my pleasure. Thank you. Okay, we've been talking with Tunji Abdul Hamid, a legal practitioner. We were talking about what the war of words in Oshun State was all about, uh, uh, mining and the revenue accruable to the state that the incoming or the present government is saying that they're seeing nothing uh, that should have come from the mining industry to the coffers of the state government. And the people who were there before the present administration are saying that they once complaining know not what they are saying. Well, we've heard from Tunji Abdul Hamid. We'll take a short break now, and when we return, we're going to be talking about something else. Stay with us.